The greatest weapon in the fight against the spread of this disease is accurate information. That is the greatest weapon. And therefore, the government is establishing itself as the source of accurate information. So the government of Jamaica is now confirming the second imported case. It is a second case, but the second case is also an imported case of COVID-19. Um, and uh, this second case is uh, a non-Jamaican who is also connected by travel from London. Having said that, the cabinet spent ex an extensive period of time discussing travel restrictions relating to the United Kingdom. The government is actively reviewing the extent of travel restrictions related to the United Kingdom. Cabinet has approved protocols for the closure of schools where the law requires the granting of a permit for any event or gathering, no permit will be issued within the next 14 days. Permits that are already issued will be rescinded, revoked. Effectively, we are placing a ban on those forms of gatherings. In terms of the Ministry of Health and Wellness, we continue to track the situation on a daily basis. The government has signaled its absolute commitment in terms of resource allocation and expenditure to ready our public health system to deal with the consequences of internal spread. And we are actively engaged now in procuring additional supplies, training our staff members, um, ensuring we have medicines, equipment, ventilators, beds, all of this in anticipation that if the model plays out the way we expect, we're going to have to see some hospitalization. Now that we have two imported cases and the possibility of more imported cases, as well as the possibility of local transmission, our strategy is really aimed at containment. How do we prevent the spread? Now, this, there's a lot of work that is on the ground now in terms of the public health department, in terms of tracing these persons. And what we want to encourage at this time is full cooperation on the part of the public. We are encouraging persons that have concerns to call, to call the Ministry of Health at the 888 One Love number, and we will offer guidance. So we want to reassure the country it's time for us to, we need to appreciate the numbers for what they are. We not, no need to panic, just a need to be concerned and to take care as we champion this particular cause uh, together. Mm -hmm.